Special News Bulletin This blue flying Pokemon will be the fleeing legend will be a legendary fleeing Pokemon that's version specific to Ruby and Sapphire. Emerald, you get a choice of what you want for blue or red. Running into the if this Pokemon happens to come up in the field, the first thing it'll do is run away and it will go to another route and chasing it is quite a chore. Very well then, but the first thing I actually wanted to get to is I will come back I will come back when I be encounter a certain Pokemon I want to find that's underwater. So if you don't mind me, I'm going to run off for a bit. I will see you when I go find that thing. And we're back! This is what I was trying to find. It's taking me a little while. Anyway, here we go! Um... Body Slam shouldn't do a ton. Good on good defenses, and it's a rock type. Okay, that's a little pain. Let's try a little something with stab. Miss me! Just gonna have to whittle it down bit by bit. Ow! Uh, this may take a little bit. We're on paralyzed. Dang it! Ugh, excuse me. Come on. <laughs> Water gun. Turn rock too. Synthesis! Give me HPs! But yeah, for a side quest for catching the legendaries, this Relicanth is something you need. Let's throw that one lone Ultra Ball first. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention, I bought a ton of items while... Oh, not. I bought a ton of items while... That will be up. I bought a... I bought a ton of items off screen. There we go. Oh yeah, I have a dive ball too. Uh, I can't talk. And there we go. Got him. Love a peep. Hate looking for these things. Yeah, we got Relican. I don't do nicknames for this run. And I deposited a few pot party members for this. Anyway, let's dive back up. And I think it's time to do a little fishing. First, let's find the super rod. Oh, it's already on my select button. Oh, yeah. From earlier. This is the first time we're going to demonstrate fishing! So yeah, when you see all these little dots and say, oh, a bite, hit the A button. I just keep doing that until something comes up that isn't a Sharpedo. You know what I say to you? Die! Go away, no one wants you. 
you kind of sucked in this generation. Fourth generation made you better though with the physical special split. Let's try this again. Not even a nibble. Come on, guys. There we go. First time. What do we get? What do we get? Oh, come on. Go away. No one wants you. Uh, it's a bite. It's more of a bite. But yeah, if you're late on the draw like that, whatever was on the line gets away. Yeah. Show us what happens when I don't pay attention. Um, here we go. You're what I needed. Sweet. Let's do this thing. Just enough damage and a paralysis too. I like this. All right. Uh, balls. I don't have any net balls. Ultra ball time, go! And the first ball gets it. But yeah, Whalmer's not necessarily what I need, but the evolution is what I need. And here's a little Pokedex ent entry. All right, no nicknames. And just for the purpose of me being impatient, I withdrew all my rare candies to level up Whalmer very quickly. I need him to 40 to evolve. I don't care. Yeet. There we go, the magic number. And there we go! This is what you need. You have to get a Waylord for the other Pokemon you need for this side quest. And also, for this, you need to put them in a specific order. And you also need the move Dig. Why Dig, I'll show in a moment. Uh, there we go. Teach our little... HM move, buddy. Dig here. Wait a minute. Tell. And now, if you don't mind me, I'm gonna go all the way back to uh, whatever that floating city is. I'm forgetting the name at the moment. I'll, I may put it on the screen. Anyway, I'll. See ya when I get there. Oh yeah, kind of forgot I didn't go through this area yet. Oops. Uh, I'll probably just skip a bunch of it. But yeah, there's a specific tower though that's on this route that I will probably show the location of, but won't be getting to right away. Anyway, I'll try to get back there. See you in a sec. Okay, just wanted to show for a moment. Uh, this is the, the location to the tower I was talking about a second ago. Uh, you could not get here before beating the champion, so just take a mild note of that. And I'm back. Anyway, uh, this is where I wanted to start from. Pacific Log Town. As you notice here, the town floats on the sea. Rather interesting, especially since somehow there's a technologically advanced Pokemon Center here. Um, not really gonna bother with that. Oh yeah. May as well just show a few things off here. Over here is the fan club 
chairman's brother. Blech. And he analyzes whether your Pokemon really likes or dislikes you and gives you a TM according to so, which is either return or frustration. As he says. And it takes about a few days for him to want you to give him or give you another one. There's a Pokemon trade in this house. I don't really do it all that much. And then there's this one. Mirage Island. It's a special island that appears only on specific conditions, uh, with some random numbers and stuff. I forget. But yeah, it appears randomly. The only thing that appears on that, there's some grass with why nots ranging from about level 5 to level 50. And there's also the game's only Liechi Berry, which, when held, the, when the Pokemon's HP drops to about half, it will consume the berry and increase its attack by one stage. This guy will tell you if Mirage Island's there or not. The other way to check is to actually physically go across that stretch of water there and check yourself. As for me, though, I'm gonna keep going this way. The rest of the house is uh, just a bit more blab. Not a whole lot that I really need to go to. And now the special condition for this route. Oh, title, it's the currents. Uh, hell here. See this? The current will automatically move you as such. You have to take this way in order to get to the next. Uh, there's a there's a tiny little dive spot here that you need to get to, and it's not that one. You can't go in that no matter what you do. I want this. You have to do this very specifically in order to get to it. And how far is it? I forget. It's about right here or so. Anyway. Um, do I just go straight? Let's give it a shot. Not. Give me a moment. Let's try this again. Here we go. Yeah, this is the dive spot you want. Dive here. This little cavern. Usual underwater music. Just keep moving along. Now you notice something weird here. Holy cow, it's Braille! Yes, there's Braille in this game. Dive! And now, very spiffy music. And what these have on them is the Braille alphabet. I conveniently have an issue in Nintendo Power, though, that actually has what translates them to. I mean, you can also look on the internet if you really want to figure it out, but anyway. Here's why you need dig. I think it's supposed to say dig here if I remember correctly. Uh, that's where you take this little guy and use dig. Bust this open. Now I just need to throw Relicanth in the front and Waylord in the back. Otherwise this won't work. And then just press A. What? There's a truck going through here? I find this weird. Anyway. These open specific caverns. Each of them with a specific puzzle. Anyway. No. 